Yes, welcome back on Dutch Motorsport. You are still here on the Mercedes stand uh, at the Geneva Motor Show. Uh, now we're gonna have a quick look at the uh, facelifted Mercedes AMG C43. Uh, we have light uh, facelifted uh, elements of the car. We're gonna have a look at the outside and inside and see uh, what we have in this updated version of the uh, C43 AMG. So maybe we can have a quick look at the back. Uh, we see all new uh, lights at the back, uh, redesigned lights. We have that uh, night lights here, uh, which change form. Uh, there are new ones. Uh, and it's a little bit darker and give a more aggressive look at the car. Uh, the, the bumper at the back is slightly modified. Uh, it stays pretty much the same. We have that uh, nice diffuser, uh, four egg, exhaust tips. Uh, two on each side, that small vent here on each side of the bumper. Uh, it was still uh, an AMG and uh, you can recognize it easily. We have also that nice spoiler lip here on the, on the trunk, uh, giving also an aggressive look at the car. And we have it in, in a really nice white color with a black roof, a uh, glossy black roof. Uh, just looks fantastic. <laughs> the front has also been uh, slightly facelifted. Uh, the, main, the main change you can find here on the headlight, headlights uh, with, have been redesigned. We have those multi-beam LEDs here. Uh, comparison with the old one. Uh, the bumper also slightly changed, but you recognize it, it's an AMG uh, and still looks pretty aggressive. Wheels, uh, as, as usual, we can recognize AMGs. Uh, we have here 19 inch uh, satin black wheels, really good looking one with huge disc brakes. Let's have a look at the figures. We have it here. As we know, it's still the V6 wheel liter, twin turbo. Uh, we have here 390 horsepower and uh, 520 uh, newton meter of torque. So let's have now a quick look at the inside. Just gonna adjust the seat a little bit. Give it a number pretty big. So here we are in the new in the inside of the facelift at C43. Uh, if you have a quick look, you think it's, it didn't change pretty much, but if you look closer, we have pretty pretty much change and improvements. We have, for example, here the steering wheel, uh, adopting the new style of uh, Mercedes AMG uh, with nice pedal shifts here. Um, Gorgeous, we have now that big screen um, and 
We have also this new uh, infotainment screen and the C43 is, I think, the only, was, the only one who doesn't adopt the dual, the kind of dual screen we have seen on the, on the A class, S class, C class. But it still, it still feels pretty nice. As you, you see that you are in a, in an AMG. Uh, we have also a nice carbon fiber here on the on the on the central dashboard. Uh, it's really nice. As I said here in the middle, we have that nice screen. Uh, you can configure and change. The, the layout of the screen if you have a classic look, a sport look or a super sport look propose here we're gonna keep the sport one get back, the style we have also the head-up display I don't know if you can see it on the camera but it's just there we have that here and pretty looks racy and really nice Phone configuration, music, radio, and I have you know, the classic ones. And the most interesting, interesting ones are here, the IMG. Uh, things you can watch, you can have a look at your boost, uh, the G, uh, G meter you can follow. We have also all the uh, the RPM meter uh, with all temperature of oil, water, uh, pressure, etc. It really looks nice. Look at the all the assistance you can have. Attention assist. Oh, what do we have else? Oh, touch it. Okay. And recognize easily it's an uh, AMG. You have a lever all the way around. So you can notice it's an EMG, uh, carbon fiber, black leather, white stitching, uh, double stitching here. It really looks really nice. Here yeah, that small tiny leather part in the middle of the, the uh, steering wheel. We have also really nice white seat belts, giving the, the aggressive look of the car. Uh, it's really nice. We have also those great looking sport seats. Here we have some configuration you can make. You can choose drive, the driving mode you have. Uh, if it's uh, if it's raining outside, you have that mode for uh, individual. You can configure uh, on your wishes, comfort, sport, and sportless. And you can also adjust here the, uh, the transmission, suspension, traction control. Uh, exhaust tips, you can have it make no, more noise uh, on board. Tiens, hey. le, le, tu vois, euh, Lionel, tu sais tout à l'heure, on pouvait pas ouvrir le coffre sur ouais. la... Ouais. Et bien regarde, ah, ouais. en fait tu déconnectes, ah, putain, ouais, tu, tu peux déconnecter l'ouverture du coffre ici. We have also the nice Burmeisters, you know, audio system in the car, looking great. Just gonna show you nice. Sports and race seats, really nice looking one, uh, made of leather.
un peu d'astuces, mais ça en fait partie. Okay. À améliorer le rendement notamment, je pense que ça vaut la peine de faire le sacrifice de oui, voilà. Nous on gagne quand même 3 chevaux de plus quand même. Il y a beaucoup de compromis qui sont faits par rapport à ça. La plupart de la voiture. So that was it for the uh, facelifted C43 ING. Uh, thanks for watching, keep following us, keep sharing, and we will do maximum thing for you and show you the best we can do.